The aim of the program was to support the emerging New Zealand dairy sheep industry and help them increase their exports. And we've done that through uh, conducting research, both on farm and off farm. Uh, for instance, helping them to increase uh, milk production on farm. Uh, and also looking at the environmental footprint of sheep dairying and looking at the composition and health benefits of the sheep milk. I got involved in this project right at the start. Uh, we decided that it needed to be a multidisciplinary program um, because we were going to have to, with a new industry, we we're going to have to cover so many bases to try and meet the challenge that we were given to grow an industry from nothing to $250 million value um, by 2020. My role in the project was with an objective one of the program, which was composition and processing. My role was to go out to the producer partners farms and collect individual sheep milk to see what variety of composition we had within the New Zealand dairy sheep genetics. It was my role also then to bring those samples back and coordinate sending samples out to our collaborator investigators at Otago and at Callaghan and Ferrier Institute and our own labs and occasionally commercial labs as well. This collaboration has been successful because we invested a lot of time, particularly in the beginning of the program, uh, to build relationships and establish trust. Um, this is a large program and we've got, uh, I think, around about 50 scientists involved from four different research providers. And we've got three industry partners. So uh, there's a wide range of different people with different knowledge, different um, backgrounds, different perspectives. And um, it was really important for us to early on in the program, try to understand each other's different perspectives and get to know each other. We've had both economic, social and environmental impact. And if we start with the economic impact, um, since 2013 when the program started, export volumes from this industry have increased by 40% and the export value by nearly 80%. And of that, it's estimated that this program has contributed about $4 million per annum. And that's quite a lot, considering that the total export value from this industry is currently about $23 million. In terms of environmental impact, uh, we've collected data in this program, and that data um, shows that sheep dairying likely has a lower environmental impact than bovine dairy. And in terms of the social impact, we've been uh, really important bringing the industry together. And this has resulted in uh, the industry being open and sharing information, also for the industry to work together and co-invest in research. The personal highlights for me have been around the teamwork that's gone into the program and uh, about the connection with industry. With the teamwork, for example, we've been able to link things like the feeding system with actually the taste properties of, of New Zealand milk and that's going to be a real advantage to us in the future in terms of that uh, grass-fed program that we have in New Zealand, the advantage that we've got. And then the other real highlight has been working with the industry and I think a really good example of that has been the work that we've done with lamb rearing and the results there that we've produced have been done directly in uh, consultation and on the uh, on our partner farms and that research has basically been taken up almost before we finished it being molded into something practical. Working with industry partners for me was very much involved with the farm staff involved in each of the producer farms. It, my job was impossible without the dairy staff who were down either in the herringbone or at the rotary assisting with actually the collecting of the milk. My role was really to interact with them so I didn't disrupt the actual commercial milking. Well I did, but not as, as very little as possible. But it, that the quality of the sample was maintained and that was the most important thing for me from my research side. But the dairy staff were always very generous with their time and they were really enthusiastic to be part of the programme. Well for me there's been two main highlights. The first one is um, the shift in attitude 
within the industry from in 2013 barely wanting to be in the same room as other producers into the situation that we have now with a, um, a New Zealand Inc. attitude, uh, an atmosphere, an attitude of, of openness and sharing and collaboration, um, uh, particularly around science, you know, co-investment in science. Um, the other highlight has been the, that we've been able to implement so much of our research already uh, with the industry. The potential for the sheep milk industry is absolutely enormous right at the moment. Um, we've worked through some of the figures. We were given the $250 million challenge. We think by 2035 we'll have a quarter of a million ewes uh, producing or returning something like $1.5 billion to the industry, to, to New Zealand's bottom line. Um, it's, it's going to be absolutely enormous because of, specifically because of the fact that we are pitching the products, new products, to next generation consumers. We're not dwelling in the past with products like cheese. We're moving on. The sheep dairy uh, program run by ag research has had a massive impact on the industry. It's really given us the confidence to shape our farm systems, to understand our milk. Uh, it's shaped our product portfolio as an industry around what products New Zealand can make, how we can highlight the benefits of sheep milk to a global audience. And I think particularly uh, really given the industry the confidence to expand and go forward. Building on the sheep dairy program, Spring Sheep is looking to extend some of the trials, particularly at the farm systems end of the program with our primary growth partnership. We'll take what's been done with ag research at the sort of the laboratory scale or the clinical scale, and we'll expand that to a farm system trial. So that's scaling up uh, some of the lamb rearing projects, some of the feeding projects, looking at different uh, farming systems and really putting them into a commercial context and scaling them out. So that'll be a huge bit of work and really beneficial for the industry. The team's absolutely thrilled to win this impact award and really our focus right from the beginning has been about industry relevant research and doing uh, what the industry needs. So uh, we're, we're absolutely thrilled about this prize. It's really a testament to all the hard work that everyone has put in, particularly in terms of building that relationship with the industry. We're going to use the prize money um, in the spirit of the program, which is about sharing information. We've got three small projects lined up. One of them is about sharing more information with the industry and also the general public to showcase how science can uh, uh, support an emerging industry. Uh, the second project uh, is about showing how this industry has changed during these six years and that will be in a form of a review article. The third project, we're going to take all the learnings from working in a large interdisciplinary program like this with multiple uh, organisations and industry partners involved and share those learnings within ag research.